Are you ready for an earthquake? Surprised you need to be? You may not be aware that our city is near a seismically active fault line, which means we are at risk of an earthquake at any time. So if the ground shakes and the building moves, remember, drop, cover, and hold on. In an earthquake, your greatest hazards are overhead. So it's important to get under something solid or into a corner or next to a wall and to stay away from doorways and windows. Cover your head, neck, and torso as best you can to shield yourself from falling or flying debris. If you're in a wheelchair, move to a wall, lock your wheels, and duck. If you're outside, move to an open area. Get away from buildings to escape falling glass or bricks, and avoid trees and overhanging power lines. If you're driving, pull over and remain inside your vehicle. Whether inside or out, stay where you are unless a greater hazard is present. For example, if you're near hazardous materials that could spill, leave the area right away and close the door behind you. When the shaking stops, wait. Allow things to settle. Look around and figure out what's next. Is it safer to stay or to leave? Avoid damaged areas and elevators. Don't pull the fire alarm or call emergency services unless there's an actual emergency. Instructions from authorities could take time. If you're trapped, don't move. Stay calm. If you're unable to use a phone, try to make noise but avoid shouting. Tap on metal or glass if you can. And then prepare for aftershocks. They can happen anytime. Now do you feel ready? Just to be sure, get prepared. Make your personal spaces earthquake ready by having bookcases, shelving, and wall hangings properly secured. If you work with hazardous materials, make sure you keep them safely contained when you're not using them. Know your exits and potential hazards around you. And if you work in an office, keep the area underneath your desk clear so that you can always drop, cover, and hold on. So now when the ground begins to shake, you'll be ready.